The Mental Health Authority is likely to be closed down by June ending as the financial challenges it faces continue. The authority has been in the news for the past few weeks of a lack of funds to support its operations. Though government has made assurances that the situation will improve, it is yet to materialize. The chief executive officer of the authority, Dr. Akwesiose, hints of a possible return to cash and carry by June ending if the situation does not improve. The mental health situation in terms of finances is dire. Now there in the sense that we are already in the middle of the, of the year and we've not had any financial releases uh, by the ministry. The mental health authority itself has been supported all along by a donor uh, partner and the support by the donor partner is coming to an end at the end of June. And if it happens that way and you're not getting support from the ministry, it means you'll be forced to shut down because you can't operate without funding. We cannot even keep our lights on. We cannot even get our cleaners to clean the place. You will be forced to shut down. On the part of the psychiatric hospitals, they will also not be able to admit patients. In their case, not so much because of the donor funding being cut. Well, not cut exactly, but the donor funding coming to an end. By the sense that they are also not getting the support they release it from the ministry and they are actually running out of funds. They are only being supported by benevolent organizations uh, and uh, philanthropies and suppliers. And their benevolence is also going down. So if they don't have any funds, then it means they will not, they will be forced either to return to cash and carry. Right, you heard Dr. Kwesiose, he is the chief executive officer of the Mental Health Authority.